Welcome back to the High School Sports Zone on location this week at BBVA Compass Stadium, home of the Houston Dynamo. Now in the world of high school soccer, it's been another phenomenal season for the Cinco Ranch Cougars. The Cinco Ranch boys advanced to state for the second straight year before losing a tough one nothing heartbreaker to undefeated Capel in last Friday's 6A state semifinals. Earlier in the day, the Cinco Ranch girls were in the state semifinals for the third straight year. An amazing achievement. The girls also dropped a heartbreaker, falling to Flower Mound 5-4 in overtime of their state semifinal matchup. Heartbreaking losses, but everybody all smiles today after a tremendous season for Cinco Ranch. And joining us now from the Cinco Ranch boys, the head coach Mason Whitfield, also Brady Johnson, a senior defender. Right, we have from the girls' side, junior Lily Bravenek, and also head coach Freddie Sanguinetti. We'll start with you guys over here, or you girl and guy. And coach, I know it's a tough loss in the state semifinals, but what a tremendous season. Your thoughts on what these girls were able to do all year long? Uh, it's an amazing season. I know from the start, uh, a lot of people didn't give us that much credit that we we're going to go back since we have been back to back. But uh, a lot of senior leadership and the girls bought into it, and just hard work paid off. So, Lily, you're still a junior, but what was you think made this team so special all season long? Honestly, I think it was our team bonding. Like, everyone gets together so well. We're all great friends, and I think that's what's got us so far is uh, our friendship. All right, we'll so. get back to you in just a second. Let's talk to the guys, Brady Johnson. And, Brady, you had this uh, tremendous header in the regional semifinals. You did it again in the finals. Uh, first, talk about winning that region championship and those goals because – you know how to use your head. <laughs> um, it, it was great to send the team to state back to back again, and um, it's been a great achievement for the guys to um, score the winning goal. was was great, and um, it's sad we couldn't complete it at state, but at least we got there. You got there for the second year in a row, Coach Mason Whitfield. And Coach, uh, how is Cinco Ranch able to get there in back to back seasons? That's a tremendous achievement. It is, and again, uh, uh, kudos to the boys. Uh, I have to give my hats off to them. I think a lot of it comes into buying in. The guys buy into what we hope they would start off in the beginning of the year working hard and uh, give us everything in practice. And in the end, it's the results that we look forward to. So. And what made this year's team so special? Senior leadership. Uh, again, same thing. Just like the girls, we kind of model a lot after each other. And the senior leadership, they step forward. And just a lot of grit, a lot of determination. I, I, you know, Again, kudos to the boys. All right. Grit and determination. You got that, right? Mm -hmm. All right. Yeah. Coach, we'll close out with you. And back for the girls back to back to back state tournaments. That's tremendous in class 6A soccer. How have you been able to do that three straight trips to the state final four? Uh, again, just a tribute to the, the girls. Uh, we also have a lot of parents that uh, support them. And you know, we have a lot of local clubs around there and just, but the atmosphere there, I mean, it's, it's one of those things that uh, you have to be there to know, but the way they work, it's amazing. All right, Lily, you're just a junior. You're gonna get back there next year? Uh, I plan on it. All right, that's a guarantee. Well, congratulations on another phenomenal season for Cinco Ranch girls and boys, and we appreciate you all being here. All right, when we come back, we'll have a very special follow-up story to an inspirational soccer player from Cy Ranch High School. Also, we'll be joined right here by a couple of homegrown Houston Dynamo. And thanks again to the Cinco Ranch Cougars. More High School Sports Zone is coming up after the break.